Hey, welcome to my first actual beauty, fashion, whatever kind of video you would like to call it. Um, this is a monthly favorites for the month of March. Woot woot. So, let's start off with hair products. I have two. And the first one is Got To Be Dry Shampoo. It was actually not very expensive. You can get it at Walmart, which is exactly where I get it. And I think I got it for about $4, which I was really happy because I never tried a dry shampoo before. And I thought I might as well try it. And I'm kind of cheap, so I thought I might as well try a cheap one, and if I liked it, maybe I could get a more expensive one. Or if I didn't like it, get a more expensive one. I don't know. But I really like this one, and it's really easy to use. The instructions are on the back. Basically, self-explanatory. If you want to skip your a night of like washing your hair, you can use this, and it'll make it fresher and not so nasty looking. So, this is definitely a must-have, and I just got like hair in my face. And the next product I have is actually almost gone, if you can see that. it's This is how much I love this product, and I've been using it for a while. It's the Paul Mitchell Smoothing Super Skinny Serum. And what I do is, when I wash my hair, I put it in my hair after I wash it, only on the times when I don't use conditioner, because I use conditioner like every other time I wash my hair, or every other two times, whatever I, whenever I'm feeling it. And um, so what I do... I just put this in my hair, put it in the bottom, work it up to the top, and it makes my hair feel really smooth. Like when I didn't use it and then when I started using it, people really noticed the difference. And obviously you can tell how much I like it. You can get it at any kind of hair place. It's a little bit more expensive, but it's definitely worth a buy. I have a makeup favorite, which is this Colossal Volume Express from Maybelline New York Mascara. It's super cute. And if you can see, it already gives your eyelashes shape. So when you put it on, it will just define them. I still recommend um, curling your eyelashes. But if you don't like curling your eyelashes, or if you really like a lot of eyelashes and don't want to use fake eyelashes, this is wonderful. Um, my next two are like fragrance. I guess you could call them fragrances. But I just really like them. I, I don't know what I'd call them what I categorize them under. This is the pink with a splash Mormon cozy all over body mist. And I have I just started using it. I actually bought it quite a while ago. But I just started using it. And it was only eight dollars. And it's super cute and it just smells very warm and cozy. Hence the name, warm and cozy. And I really like it. And it's just easier to spritz on and it's not as expensive as like the and I pointed to my very expensive Taylor Swift and Selena Gomez perfumes. So it's not as expensive as those, but I really like this. And then the other things are these little travel pack Bath and Body Works antibacterial hand gels. A dollar, a dollar twenty-five, whatever it is. This one's Nectarine Mint, and it just smells very nice, and the cute little beads, and I always take it out at the restaurants and have people wash their hands, if, or if they use the restroom in a public place and think that's disgusting. This is awesome. Um, a fashion favorite I have is actually these earrings. And I think I've been wearing them almost every day. So, sorry about that, earrings. But I got these from Forever 21 in a pack of three. And they're just like little studs. And they were only three eighty for the pack of three. And I don't even know if I've worn the other ones. Oh yeah, the ones were pearls and then... The other ones were flowers, and I have not worn those yet. But I love them. I think they're really cute. Sorry, I'm a little sick. Um, but I really, really like them. And my last, like, favorite that I can actually, that's actually tangible, that I can touch, is this. It's like a food favorite. It's Eclipse. I don't know what. Winter Frost Gum. I like how they have the double packs. It's easy to carry. And I just love them because they're like the price of one, but you get double the packs. Love it. Tastes delicious. Keeps my breath nice and fresh. Amen. Um, my song favorite of the month is actually more like an album. I bought the Perks of Being a Wallflower album. Amazing. Absolutely. Absolutely amazing. I have never heard anything. And a lot of the songs are like 80s and 90s music, but what you'll learn about me is that's definitely my style. So I really love that. Love the music in that. Amazing. 
perfect. And my favorite is like the last the last two songs if you have the album and if you just don't buy the songs you'll hear Charlie he's talking about being infinite and all that junk which is not junk but just saying and then We Are Hero by David Bowie I think yeah David Bowie comes on perfect my movie favorite of the month is Identity Thief I went to see that with my mom on her birthday weekend hilarious. It's with Melissa McCarthy who's my woman crush and she just cracks me up and it's super cute and it's a good story and I would recommend seeing it. I don't know if it's still in theaters but you could go check your local theater or online. It's worth a try. So that is my favorites for the month of March. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you will subscribe, like, comment, do all that good stuff and stay in for more because I'm sorry this is my first couple videos I really hope it's gonna get better I'm just kinda nervous and it will get better I actually have for my next video I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a spring break haul because I just went to Florida and I would love to do a haul for you with all my like clothes that for Easter and all the clothes I got down there and because I was in Orlando so that'd be fun so stick around because it's gonna be a lot of fun and like this comment, subscribe, and be my friend because I want to be yours.